Revelation news looking rough. You know, I'm sleeping in the car. The car is my 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 love. It has to be. Because it's the case that you're looking at a male individual that fucked up really bad. But every video I make, uh, which isn't probably going to be too many, but I'm going to get... I, 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 I'm trying to get this gig. There's a convenient mart here and they're looking for somebody and I just got to convince them uh, and pray for me if you're a Christian or otherwise pagan, whatever. I, I'm really spiritually just in light. If you stand for the light, like uh, New Agers call it, uh, light workers, I'm down with you, okay? We have what you would call, if, and, and there's going to be Christian communes. We're going to have to do this soon because it's going to be World War III. Uh, I heard from a tweet, I think it was Shani, in a tweet or something. She's going to block me soon on everything which that'll be horrible because I could still get to see her face a little bit, but she, she's blocked me in a few places. So, and that's for her safety because I am codependent. But anyway, that's personal. Uh, it turns out that, that, that it looks like Vladimir, the impaler who has uh, it apparently metastatic cancer that it, I think it's going to his brain. Okay. Because he's acting like a psychotic. So it's either that his brain is shutting down and he was a Christian man and doing good and now his brain shutting down and the devil stepped in, the Antichrist spirit. And he's fulfilling what he, lots of Bible prophecy, uh, you could say Alex Jonesy uh, type shit, infoy, warsy type things. Prophecy guys, Tex Mars, uh, back in 2000, uh, were saying that Putin was going to be the Antichrist. So we got interesting stuff. This is popping off. It, we're going to have World War III. Now, the question is, is they, are they, is them, are they, and it's an N with an O at the end. New and, new and, new, 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 da 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 See, I like the wolf pack better. We're going to do wrestling shows, and I want to apologize to Mindbender. You know, Mindbender, I love you, man, and I'm going to unblock you on my email, and I'm going to try and apologize. I've been so paranoid with unmedicated status that this shit with, hap with prison happened, and, and I, I even acted out on my son, who's a little innocent, autistic boy, and I have to deal with that now for the rest of my life that I did that. Hang on, I'm going to turn this on really quick, okay? Because it's a little stuffy. I got good news though. Oh. I'm on E and it's stuck on E. We're, that's copyright. That's copyright. I'm, I got my mom's old music playing in this, in this car. And uh, it just, it's, it's everything. There's the air. And it's, I'm going to put it on Econ. We're going to save batteries. We're good. We're going to do an auto fan. Oh, it's so cool. Even just with the econ. All right. This video. What the fuck? Revelation news videos. If you remember me from the old days, even to a fault, I was not the one to cause offense or want to divide. I had an entire playlist of almost 20 some odd videos of me speaking on the name of the playlist was Christian Unity. I was the cookies and cream Christianity guy according to the con man that I believe. Now, I pray for forgiveness from Jesus Christ immediately, but what I see is something very weird. Or maybe Rand Campbell, that day on Facebook, this exposes something that you made me feel like I was something worse. Not, where the hell is the money for the kids, was your quote, Rand. I said, Rand, I can barely put gas in my tank anymore. I was broke at the point. But I, I, I wanted to give him money for the kids in, in, in where he's at. But I didn't have it anymore. Anyway, he made me f He was like a televangelist evil f fucker. And Hillary Pugh, come on my channel. You're right. 
we could do an interview and, you know, talk, man. Shani loves you, and I love you. You're awesome. You got great intentions. And, and like Laura, uh, formerly uh, CJ, uh, Laura, she is such a great person to talk to. And I, the hangouts, you know, they were good. But that's, the, I'll do another video on that. And just, I really loved a lot of you people. So, Hillary Pugh, you know. Shani loves you. You know, you guys had great discussions, and, and Laura, too, with you guys. I know. And there's a bond there. It's beautiful. You know, it's love. It's love. Because, cause, cause, cause I, I, you know, Shani's Aspie. That definitely. I think I am, too. And that's why medication is fucking everything, you know. And, and I'm struggling because, I, you know, my doctor, he's trying to get, I have, I was able to get to a pharmacy where I'm at. This is the good news before I, I'm going to give you good news from me that I'm doing okay, okay? I'm only on Wi-Fi when I can grab it, and that's why the videos are, I don't even know how the quality is coming out, but you can tell me. Um, I, I have a friend in southeastern area of PA, and that's where I'm at, and I'm in his lot. He ha he's got like acres of land, my buddy. And he said, you take that area and keep it clean. You're cool. Stay. Sleep in your car and, and do your sh shit. And if you get a job, that's fucking awesome. You know, you don't have to pay me shit, though, because I love you. And he's a Christian brother, so that's it. That's where I'm at. And I can stay here as long as I need to. And I'm working my way back to you, babe, with a burning love inside. That's uh, 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 the Four Tops. No, Frankie Valley and the Four Seasons. Sorry, Frankie Valley. And look that song up right now. It's on. It's at go to the J Tunes. I, I think that's public. If it's not, it will be. I made everything on my channel public, and when I get a desk, my I have no desktop computer. I gave the Alienware three thousand dollar thing. I left that with William because he is going to be a billionaire. Uh, he's he's already working on games So I made the decision the last time I was in the house to get my shit I got my iPhone with this nice little you know, you can hear me uh, My Neumann's gone. I uh, uh, I have no computer so I'm operating on just a phone and You're gonna get stamps from from where I was aha. That's a crazy thing, but I'm not there It's an old stamp. It's not track. I turned off tracking all that shit. I, I'm on like it's almost a hacked iPhone, but it's not hacked. It's still got the chip from the company. I was, I was with Verizon. It's just the bill. I have to pay a 875 $1,500 Verizon phone bill for my boys and, and Shani. It's all in one, and it's like overdue three or two, two and a half years. So that's that. But yeah, uh, uh, the convenient, yeah, I'm probably going to work there. You know, it's it's a fucking Valero, whatever's out. Yeah, it's like Valero's mostly in the southeast. I'm I'm uh, PA that I'm seeing, but my buddy is awesome and he's cool. So I, I I'm good. I this car is exactly what I needed at the time, and my uncle hooked me up with 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 a loan. I'm paying him back as soon as I I'm gonna start saving little portions of uh, my assistance money when I get it and and I'm gonna put it aside for my uncle to pay him back he hooked me up with 1500 and I'm, I'm just shouting out Thomas Davis and loving on him and don't email him he doesn't listen to you okay if you're trying to convince my uncle that I'm a horrible kid like he he already reprimanded me when I came here and I deserved it I had seven hundred thousand dollars in the fucking stock market, and one and two, one house I gave to him to keep in the family. I, because I owned the play, the place in Peckville, and I signed it over to him for a dollar because he wanted to keep it in the family. I was going to sell it myself and have another two hundred thousand dollars in my in my Apple stock, and and then start crippling, then start trickling like a thousand, two thousand, which was nothing to me. A thousand, two thousand into some crypto and build a crypto portfolio with with bitcoins and 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 the whole the standards of the cryptos. And put a million dollars, put save up, save five hundred thousand dollars, 
and you put that into Dogecoin. And you send the market off on that, and then you have your Twitter, which I was trying to develop, Jason Avocados 420 hashtag Doge. You know, and I was I got I got shout outs from man, I need a drink, you know. Stay high. Okay, this is your time to go hydrate. Sorry. I have to get to the negative. I'm being positive right now. I'm gonna do a thumbnail. You know, they, he's gonna call me a Satanist for this probably he I don't know if he'll come back. I think he fucked his life. And I I'm just gonna like Josh, your name is Josh Barrett. We were brothers in Christ, too. I would have taken a bullet. I would have been beheaded for your kid, your kids, huh? I, your wife. I would have died for your wife. Uh, I love you to this day. But the dog shit, and I'm going to be aggressive because you're a fucking strong fucking guy, okay? I need to gain weight and build muscle like you, man. You look amazing, all right? I, you, you were, I always wanted to see you as like you're older than me, I'm pretty sure, or you're around the age, a brother, like blood brother. And I like, like I looked up to you. You're a nurse. You're taking care of people, but you're manly. You're awesome and a Christian man. Brother, I'm going to preach to you from the Spirit, and this is not to be hateful, but you're a Calvinist. And I'm going to tell you that John Calvin... While his points were very prescient and, and valid and, and biblically sound, he is still a man. And there is a spirit connected to Calvinism. This is a video that, that I, really, I am in the end. I feel that Jesus Christ's sandal foot. And please, Josh, you see this, remix this. I'll look out for free, free fall 82nd, my brother, and I almost cried. Okay? The dog shit of you coming at Shani when you know nothing of her. When I asked you, you D, you, you, P, the, no, this was a text message because that's a, Look, folks, there, there has been maybe two, three people on the entire internet, including, including Shani, who I love. Working my way back to you, babe. I'm praying for that, and I, I feel it. In your heart. Yeah. Do you get me, honey? In your heart. Spirit. To be comfortable with me again, because I want that reunion. I'm only in South... I could get back to you real quick. If, if all of this stuff with, with the cops and, and, and the protection shit and all that is gone, we can do it. I look like Nick Nolte mixed with uh, Tana Mojo with a, with a goatee. Anyway, here's the deal. Josh Barrett, and I'm saying your name because that's how we were like, we could have been blood. Why you call my woman a devil? Because that's what you message me in, in a message, Josh. Free fall 82nd. We did an interview and we, we had channels popping back in 2013, 12, 14. We do, we do, we, we that's still, I got to pay for the, the BTR because that, the stuff we talked about is so relevant. The ley lines, the planet, it, it's amazing. Come back, Josh. But I want you to repent to the Lord for Calvinism because it's, it's, it's hateful towards women. It's a chauvinistic Protestantism. And you can call me a devil now because, uh, because I tell you the truth, I become your enemy. What did Jesus Christ, did Jesus Christ say anything about philosophy? No, he talked about the kingdom coming and about loving God and people. How are you showing my wife, and then you're calling me a brother, how are you showing my wife any respect as me as your brother by calling her a devil for no reason? And I asked you, I asked you how many, how many times, Joshua, how many times, Joshua Barrett, did I ask you, why are you calling my wife a devil and you would not answer me and you know this is true? Well, whatever, brother, I, I guess we're done. Well, I guess we, no, we're not done because there is a steel rod in my heart because I love you like a brother, a blood brother. We cried together a few times, dude. I was there when the Sandra, 
that bullshit. I don't know what happened. Were you mean to your wife? Because Calvinism is, is anti-woman. That's what you need to know, Josh. I see these Calvinists, they're MGTOWs. You know, you MGTOW, Josh? You got to repent to Jesus Christ right now. And this is a brother to brother in love. Jesus bless you. I love you, brother. But Shan Shani, look, she loved you. She knew your videos before I told her about them. She was a follower of you probably since you had a channel. She's deeply into prophecy. She shuns it somewhat now because it's been used for bullshit. And come on, Josh. What happened, Scotty Clark? This poor man, Scotty Clark. MGTOW, are you guys all Calvinist MGTOWs? You got to repent to Jesus and love the women. You look at the woman form and it evokes so many different emotions in the body and you want to chastise yourself and you want to break your body down and build it up again and be a man. And I want to do that where we're going. I see Shani and me somewhere after the reconciliation because Jesus said, this woman is your soulmate and you called my soulmate, Josh, a she devil a devil you called her a devil why this is to all the fans of free fall 82nd that love him as much as i do at josh barrett please repent to jesus for your hatred of women something's going on in your life you're very aggressive you're like and you disappeared your name was tetelestai and i was going to watch the videos you you're just gone they deleted your shit because you were talking about That's it. The communists. You have to... Look, this is a plea to, to people that still have a brain to see what's happening. Vladimir Putin said today globally that he's, he's going to nuke the United Kingdom. It, London. Vladimir Putin has said... That he is going to nuke. Vladimir Putin has said. <clears throat> from the Central Texas Command Center. I can't handle it folks. Okay. Do I have to pull up the fucking headlines and see. Today. In 2022 folks. Okay. Joe Biden's America. Right. I have to pull up the fucking headlines and read to you that Vladimir fucking Putin just said that he's ready to nuke fucking London. This is fucking madness, folks. That's what that guy's saying on his show. I don't watch it because of tr it, it, it's, it's triggering to me now, too, because Shani, I cut out Alex with Shani. I can't go back to listening to him because my, my anxiety, ah, because I have PTSD from the fucking cops in Boulder coming into my house and smiling at me what the fuck why are you smiling at me you are violating my fourth amendment you have no right to be here you falsely arrested my fucking wife get the fuck out of my house pigs now and they smiled at me and winked and said have a nice day sir then i got sir papers you go to court and that was vindicated by jesus totally because i had a godly judge judge martin who is still in colorado he's in district 11 now though he is a just impeccably perfect judge judge martin district 11 colorado god bless him it, we, he and god already blessed him with great wisdom he's a con he's counseled by the lord which is how your judges need to be. We pray for the nation, right? The prayers of the saints go to the altar and the incense. And, and the, they're burned in heaven. And then the Lord honors that with action on earth. That's how the prayers work. But it has to be, it cannot be from your mind. Like I want a billion dollars. I was praying for like one million to put into Apple. Because that would really help me. We got some Broncos going down the road, I think. We, 
I got a friend, and and he's got a he's got all these plots, man, because he just he works as like mechanic job type nickel and dime you, right? He's an awesome guy, and he doesn't fuck people. They just all come to him because they get these blower mufflers that are like, right, and the fucking fire comes out the back of it. And some of them got knots out here. They don't fucking care because it's just America, you know? Like, the Amish won't go there, but they'd have knots on the fucking carriages. They're, abs they're amazing people, and I wish I grew up Amish. You know, I'm aspiring. This is going to be out here. I'm not... I don't have any razor, so this is going to all grow out. I'm going to just look like the dude. I don't have my sunglasses. Oh, fuck. Yeah, I do. I, oh, I got the dude hat and the glass. Yeah, I got it. It's in a bag in the... Anyway, my friend's awesome, and he's like, just hang out and do your videos, and, and you can do whatever you want. Just don't make too much noise, and, and because we don't want any fucking whatever. He's like, yeah. He's like, here's here's twenty bucks. Put five or ten in the tank, because this thing is. It's on E, and it's it just runs per perfect. Where is it? Here. It's just fucking incredible. Shit, it's old. You get what I'm saying? But people walk by. It's awesome here. It's just a lot. And it's green. And I'm in southwest Pennsylvania. That's all I'm going to tell you. For my real people that want me okay. Josh Barrett needs to repent to Jesus Christ. Trey Smith. I love Trey Smith. This. Josh, do you get it's a spiritual thing. It's over. You were wrong about Shannon. I have to air the car out. It's fumes. It's the noxious fumes of, of the devil, man. Do you understand, Josh? This window doesn't go down. I have to get this door repaired. I'm gonna this is this is like my world right now i'm gonna i have a friend that's really good with cars and he's like i'll i'll i'll, I'll do everything you need man plus where it will make it like new almost i'm like what the lord does this shit jeff he, i mean how do you find these people you get out and live in the dra the dragoons and and people that are on drama i can speak all these names now because they're, i'm not the suing shit is like, yeah, if I get in a place to, some some people might get sued. But I, I, I don't hate any of y'all, buddy. I'm sitting here blessed by Jesus. I got my iPhone. I can charge it at certain places. I can make videos. I'm happy. You know, it, happy? No, not until that. I'm working my way back to you, babe. And I'm not going to listen to the Roy Orbison song, Crying. I was alright for a while. I could smile for a while. But then I saw you last night. You held my hand so tight. As you stopped to say hello. And the point of the song is he's crying because he's realizing that the, the, time, the time he spent with his love was just all a dream. It was bullshit. It never happened in reality. Roy Orbison is my, I my God. He's, he's, he, when, at, when Elvis was asked what his biggest influence was, and this is bullshit because big, Elvis's biggest influence was uh, black, black uh, rock and roll. All of it. It was uh, that their amazing music back in the day you want the best music listen to the old rock and roll the black bands and that's not a racist statement that was rock and roll was the oh my god it's good shit just listen to it that was elvis's biggest influence though is roy orbison okay his number one influence and then johnny cash came in and said hey king i got some shit that oh my god what yeah now you put this up, you know. Ah, uh, old school, man. 
my grandpa, Egroth, had this car, except it was a different color. So, Josh, my wife is from Jesus. I really believe that a lot of the Calvinist movement has gone MGTOW because it's like this weird chastisement with sexuality and weirdness. I'm not going there. I'm not a Calvinist. I was a, I was a four-point Calvinist for like two months. And then I realized, you guys, you, your spirit is in a lot of ways dead. You lost your first love. You have to return. Chuck Mistler used to say the Calvinists in the Protestants apply to the one letter to the churches that's failing. Sardis, whatever. In Revelation, the letters to the churches. Calvinism is failing because you lost your first love which is love of people first. No, holy, sorry, rebuked, incorrect. You first love God. I'm gonna end this 30 minute video because I need a drink and I have to go walk a little bit. And I got, I, he gave me like fucking a hundred bucks. So I'm, this is how Jesus works. You know, I, I'm just being taken care of by a brother by grace. It's amazing, and I'm using his lot for free for now. As I figure this out, I got the phone so I can absolutely make calls and receive calls. This is phenomenal. Like, I'm just going to set things up. I'm going to prove myself to Shani, and then I want that. Anyway, you're ca Josh, you called you call Shani a devil, and I'm telling you that she loved you like a really by your cute and everything you know that she wouldn't mind me saying because you're really a good looking man so uh come back i want my brother 